Hello my good people. Welcome to today's tutorial. So today I want to take you on a step by step on how to retrieve a lost KRA pin, a lost Kenya Revenue Authority identification uh, personal identification number and also how to retrieve an official email address that you use during the KRA pin registration. Remember, most of us don't even remember the email address that we use during the KRA registration. So today I'm going to show you on how to retrieve KRA, a lost KRA pin or a forgotten KRA pin and a KRA address using your phone. How do you see that? So before we go there, I want to talk about what you call backup. We have so many backups in life. We have what you call financial backup, spiritual backup, and any other backup that you can talk of. So today I want us to talk about what you call solar. I know most of us where we come from, we have we are our places are connected to electricity grid. But if you are look if you are looking for a solar backup, I would advise you to go for Sun King. Just from the word King, Sun King is the best. It has a long duration, a long lasting battery, so that you cannot be disappointed. Also, they have different products. They have TV screens, they have solar lamps, they have even fan that you can use to cool you during the daytime. They also have even the lamps that has got radio. So imagine you have light and at the same time you can listen to radio. Two in one. Those opportunities are very rare in life. Two in one. So if you are trying to look for a solar, I would advise you to go for Sun King. If you want to talk to them, you can call the numbers that are rolling below so that you can be directed to any agent near you where you're coming from. So just call and you'll be directed to the agent next to your location. So remember, solar See your solar. Solar ne Sun King. So let us go direct to today's tutorial. Guys, I would advise you, don't take your information to other people, not unless trusted. Because if you can take your ID number to retrieve an KRA pin, and then after that, after a short period of time, an SMS in your phone prompting you to pay a loan because we are in a digital world and we are in 21st century. They have your ID number and they have retrieved your KRA pin. So they can do anything using your details. So I want you to share this video as to many as possible to curb the situation. Remember this Kiswahilian says, uh, at the, uh, I don't know, prevention is better than cure. So let's go direct to the tutorial. Otherwise, welcome. So when you don't have your KRA pin or you misplace it, and you are wondering how you can get back your KRA uh, pin, it's very simple. Let us go step by step on how to retrieve your KRA pin. Uh, so this is what we are going to do. First step is to go to the Play Store. Then from Play Store, look for an app called KRA M Service. So KRA M Service app. So you, you look, uh, click on it and then it will have a logo that looks like the one which is displayed on the screen there. Then install it. After installing it, you can open it or you can always go back to your phone and then look uh, where it has been installed like in this my case it has been installed here it is on the the home page so i click click on mrm service and then after that uh you wait and then a page uh, that looks like the one on the screen will be open and then in that case just click on forget password then from forget password enter a valid id number so when you enter we enter a valid ID number, then click on forget password. And then you will be directed to another page that looks like the one that you see here. Your ID number will be displayed there automatically. So enter email address. In this enter email address, you can enter your email address or you can enter any, any email address that you know. Or you can even enter 1234 at gmail.com or 1234 at yahoo. So long as it's something that looks like an email address. So like in this my case, let me just enter an email address there. Um, let me let me enter uh, try to enter a valid email address then after that i will simply come and write phone number just write any phone number that you have it doesn't really matter so let me type a phone number then after that i click on submit then from submit you will realize that my uh, my i've already done this in the previous tutorial that i was maybe sending to somebody and that's the reason why i've been told that user the pin you can see the pin is there the pin you can see is there and the email you have a bit, a bit told that email address is not unique so it doesn't matter whether you have placed the your 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 
you have typed the correct email address or not. So the most important thing that you want is your KR pin, and then you can see it is there already. So that one, you don't worry, the KR pin is there. You can screenshot and save it, or you can copy it. The email that you have, you used during the registration is simple. Just go to your Google uh, Chrome uh, search, and then from there, uh, we go to Google search. From Google search, just type the word ITAX, I-T-A-X. A tax I T A X then search then from the search scroll down to look for what we call K R A E tax HTTP A tax dot K R A dot G O dot K E that is what we want then click on it to open then K R A E tax uh, portal account will be open now this is the K R A portal account now for those who don't like maybe the phone view you can change this into a computer view or a desktop view, we always click on the three dots here and then check on what we call desktop site and then your uh, phone will be changed into a computer view where you can now view everything at a glance rather than scrolling left and right. So in such a case, let me just go back to a phone view. So this is my phone view and then I'll just come back here and then I want to retrieve the email address that I used and I have forgotten about it. So I'll jump, simply come and click on what we call report problem so i click on report problem then a new page will be launched here so from the page here i will not do anything else i'll just come directly to the pin because i've already have my pin i've already retrieved my pin so i just click on the pin there and then i i type the valid pin number remember you type the valid pin number so the, i will type the pin number that i already retrieved from the krm service site so I type on, I click on it, and I will click on the pin, and then type the 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 KRA pin that I've already retrieved. And then after typing the KRA pin that you've already retrieved the other side, just click outside. Don't click on any bo any active box. Just click on any out outside the box where it is not active. So like in this part, you can click on that part, and then once you click on it you will see that the email address will automatically appear where it's written email. It will appear automatically there. And then now you can now use that email address to log in.